Hello, and welcome back for another episode of the Alphabet Challenge. I am doing the letter J. Um, I'm actually going to do the same thing that the other girls have done, and it, it's jumbo. Because I was looking up, and I was just like, what the world do I do for J? So, um, both, um, both the other girls did it. Miss Gail did it. Um, so I'm going to follow in Sue and we're going to do jumbo. I happen to have these ginormous, um, like they don't even fit in my screen. These ginormous tags, um, they are, let's see, <laughs> they're a little ridiculous. Um, they are 10 inches, 10 and a half inches tall. And they are five and one eighth inch wide. So yeah, I think I think we're safe to say that this consists of jumbo. So um, yeah. Um, so without further ado, I guess I will start the clock and. We can start. Okay. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to fold these up because they're way too big to go into any journal the way that it's already sitting. Because um, not many journals are, well, I guess, yeah, because it, no, because eight and a half by 11 gets folded long ways. So yeah, they're, they're way too big to go into a journal. So we're going to, we're going to make pockets out of them. Um, they're not all necessarily going to be the same size because I'm just straight eyeballing this. Um, I have a measure stick, but I don't necessarily use it for its intended purposes. I use it to take my pictures on the shop. Does that count? Hey, they all ended up right around the same size. This one's just ever so slightly bigger. All right, um, now I'm gonna use my doohickey folder, foam folder here, and we're gonna, oi, oi. And make sure we get those squished. All right, um, that should be good. So we'll just do one at a time. And I want to color. Um, so I'm just going to grab some random color. Uh, this is pastel pink is what this one's called. And I'm going to ink this bad boy. No, I'm not because that doesn't show up. I'm going to, I don't know if that one's just too pale or what. It might just be too pale. Let's see, what color are you? Oh, this one's metallic chalk edger. Ooh. Uh, that one looks like I don't know if I can use that because the pad is completely off of the thingy. Oh, that's pretty. Pastel blue. Maybe that one might show up. This one is also a metallic chalk edger lead. This one's platinum. Old road. Ooh, green. I should have probably done this before rusty bucket. All right, let's play with those. All right. Um, I'm probably making someone nervous. I know sometimes um, I used to get comments that I would make people nervous when I held a knife. Which is funny because every time my kids hold a knife, I also get nervous. They know how to use a knife, but, um, oh, this one's away from the thing too. Look, see, 
Well, fiddle fart. Ugh. Okay. I don't know how to fix those. Um, we'll have to play with those a little bit. Um, okay. Um, <laughs> this is going to make me cry. All right, we're just going to try it. Okay, I'm just going to put ink all over everything, apparently. All right. Um, so this one's a dark gray. I like this. This is cool. Oh, it's coming off. Yeah. All right. You know what? Um, this. I don't know if this is going to work, but. Maybe it will melt the ink pad onto the thing. No, it's not working. It just cooled the glue completely immediately. Okay, um, well, that's not, oh crap, I already started. Okay, well, my hands are going to get super messy. Alright, um, I'm going to do the other side too. Um, I'm not sure how old these are. I don't imagine that you buy them brand new and the pads come off. Uh, I did buy these used, so they're, you know, they're however old they are. Now, as long as you don't mind getting ink all over your fingers, they ink really well. But that's kind of the design of the um, the inker is to so you can hold it like that. Um, we and obviously this is not going to be a oh let's be pretty. I mean, I want it to be pretty, but. We're using dark gray. All right. Um, let's see. I'm just going to add some more zhuzh since, you know, we've got it out and it's all over my fingers. It is inevitable that I touch something. Oh, good job. Fingerprint. Oh, check that out. I'm just using the ink off of my fingers and wiping it down with a baby wipe. It's literally all I'm doing. All right. So now that we have this, you know, all over everything, um, I'm not sure if I'm going to use those again. I might, I don't know how to fix that. I just tried, but it's, I'll have to give it to my husband or something because I don't know how to fix that. Okay. So that's pretty, but I can't. Oh, wait, maybe. What happens if we do that? Oh, pretty. That's too big, though. Okay. Um, what about you? You're kind of big, too. Ooh, I like that. Um... Let's see, how wide are you? Um, come here, stick. No, that's too wide. I was trying to see if it would um, go on a standard journal page, but it's six inches across and that's too wide for a standard journal page. 
Um, ooh, you're pretty. And it's got the dark colors too. That's cool. Um, okay. Let's add some blue. This is more of like a, a smoky blue. This is one of the laces I have left. Like, obviously, it's not a yard. Um, I think I'm going to go up to the bottom. I don't know what this is going to look like, so bear with me. I lost my scissors. I buried my scissors, I think, is what happened. Scissors, where are you? I just had you. Spend all my time looking for my scissors. Alright. I'm just going to make this straight. My husband's in there playing with my daughter. I don't know what they're talking about, but I can hear them messing around. Alright, so I'm just going to put like a little tiny tab of glue just so I can anchor this down. And then I can put the rest. It's getting caught at the top. Ah, it's messing me up. Now we have pretty on both sides. And you can make this into a pocket. I think I'm just going to leave it as a flip for now. Oh, that's really cool. I like that. I love the dark colors. Oh, that is so, so cool. Okay, I think... Um, let's see, I want to implement this somehow, but I'm not sure how. All right, I'll just leave it be for now. Let's see what kind of stuff we have over here. I think I want to put something right in the middle of that bow. Just like that. Alright. So, oh, I moved it. Alright. Okay. And, if you leave the heart open, you can have like another little I think I'm going to do that. Have an extra little pocket. A pocket! Right there. Okay. And then... Whee! Put that right on top of the bow. I like that a lot. All right, so I think we're for the other ones, we're going to stick with traditional inking because um, these obviously made a mess all over the place. I opened like three of them and the pad came off. I was like, no! And as you saw, I opened them. So um, they probably just are old. Even though they're still sealed, I think they're just old, which is fine. I mean, Stuff happens all the time. I need to find my ink. I'm losing everything. I have so much stuff on my desk, y'all. It is insane. All right. So, let's see if we can't cover this one in gray ink. <laughs> That'd be funny. Not so much, but... Come out. 
By the way, I love this brush. It is fantastical. Uh, you can get them on Amazon. You can get them on Wish, AliExpress, if you like those websites. I know some people don't. I get my stuff from eBay. I get my stuff from Amazon. I get my stuff from AliExpress. I am not. I am not picky. As long as it's pretty, I will buy it. And as long as I have money for it, I mean, obviously. And then, I probably should have pre-inked these. Oh my gosh. Just the inking phase is taking a while. Alright. Okay. That feels so weird on my knuckle. Because I'm pushing it against my knuckle so it doesn't go anywhere. Feels weird. The ink pad, I mean, is what I'm talking about. It's funny. I remember when we lived in Washington, I would, um, I'd be making stuff for Happy Mail or whatever, because I used to do swaps all the time. Um, and I would always be inking stuff. So we would be sitting there playing our video game, because one of the video games that we like to play has a lot of downtime while you're waiting for matches and such. And um, a friend of mine would always be like, yep, she's inking. <laughs> I'm just like, yep, I'm inking. It's funny. And he's not a crafter. But he always knew when I was inking because of that sound. Alright. It's warm. And I don't have liquid. Oh no. Okay. So, I have some more of these little fabric doohickeys. Um, let's see, what do I want to put in the back? Um, let's see. got some stickers. We can do some stickers. Oh, we can add stickers to the other one. Ooh, that'll be a nice pack for that one. I don't know if I'm going to put stickers on this one. Let's see. Um, I've got some more of the fabric doohickeys. Oh, this is hard. I don't normally decorate stuff this big. Ooh. I like the hearts. The hearts are pretty. Oh, this one would be perfect, actually, because it's like... Takes up all that space there. And then in journal and such. Oh, I like that. I'm going to put that there before I change my mind. All right. And I'm not making this one into a pocket. Just make it in into a heart glued onto a tag. Oh no! Alright. Okay. Alright. And then for so this part here. I want to put something there, but I don't want it to be like so overpowering. Maybe a smaller heart. Ooh, a double heart. There we go. And this one's got the same ribbon on it. Okay, let's do that, but let's put that like this ribbon looks yellow. It's not yellow. <laughs> I just realized that. Like, whoa, that is very yellow. It is not. My camera is fibbing. Um, 
Um, how about we do that and then maybe put a flower instead. And go in there. Go in the hole. Oh, okay. Um, that there. And that. Oh wait, oh my! I was like, oh, I can't see it. There we go. And then. That's too much. I think that might be too much. Oh goodness gracious, now I don't know what to do with this thing. Um I think we are going to spend a lot of time on this. And okay, that's good. Like that. Let's do that. Whee! Da -dum, da -dum. Colors is playing outside. We're on, uh, we're on a military base, for those of you who don't know. And Colors plays in the morning and at night. I think one is called Taps and one is called Colors. I don't, I don't know. Okay, there we go. That is better, way better. Now it's not quite so empty. I like this. I feel like you can't see that little pearl. There's a little pearl right there. I don't think you can see it. But I like this. that one aside. Let's figure out what we're going to do with this one. Um, I don't know if I want to ink this one because um, I do want this flower. Right there. Ooh, we used the blue again. That was really nice. Nope. I like the blue, but we're going to have to put something here. All right. So let's anchor this bad boy down and see if we can't catch it on the top again. Because it like messes up the alignment. If there's tension on against it, you know. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Probably not. I don't know what I mean half the time. All right. Okay. And now we'll trim this. And then, ooh, we can make this one into an actual pocket. Instead of a flippy flip.
<clears throat> um, let's see. What have I got over here? That's pink. Um, ooh, that's pretty. I like that. I think maybe do that instead. Oh yeah, most definitely like that better. <clears throat> I'm just waiting for these to kind of seal down. Otherwise they'll just poke back up. All right, let's see, blue in the middle and kind of kind of off the side, but not too much because there's not a whole lot of wiggle room with this um, as far as traditional journal size, uh, journal page sizes. Now obviously you can have bigger journals, but if you make your products to sell, you want to kind of go with tradition or traditional sizes, it'll be easier to move. And if you're looking to gift away and you don't necessarily know what kind of, like what size journals they make, you could ask them. Or if you just make a regular traditional size, um, that's a pretty safe measurement. I have ink everywhere. Look at that. That's funny. Oh, I love that. Oh, I don't know why my throat is so froggy. Probably because I don't have a drink. Normally I have a drink sitting right in front of me. I have purple ones too. Look at that. Oi. I love those things. They're so much fun to play with. Obviously I've used them in the last two videos I think. That and doilies. I love Mason doilies. Alright. So, I've got some seam binding here that we can use for some, okay, that's tissue paper everywhere, goodness gracious. Could learn how to tie. That'd be great. And then, ooh, we could even make it go this way. That way, the tails go up. And then, if you wanted to, you could glue it so it doesn't move. Way the tails go up like that. Oh, that's really cool. I like that idea. I'm just like flatten it out a little bit. I 
I'm just putting a little tiny bit of glue to kind of force the bow to stay down. Ow. And I'm going to burn my thumb. Oh, you could put something in the middle. I have I have stuffs. Um dilly do. Oh, there's metal. I do metal. That'd be pretty. Um uh, there you are. I was just like, where did my E6000 go? Nice big old blob. I'm putting a big old blob because it's uh, concave inward. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it like goes inward. So I have to fill that. There we go. Oh, that is so cool. I really like that. Oh, that scared me. I like that a lot. All right. So this one's an actual pocket. A pocket pocket. And this one is a flip. So you can write. And you can do like stamps in order to create the lines if you don't feel comfortable writing without lines. <clears throat> There's that one. Um, let's clean up just a smidge since, you know, I have everything on my desk at the moment. It's a little absurd. I brought this out and didn't even use it. And that can go back. Nope. I'm liking this, though. I got this, um, second hand as well, and I am liking these. I've used several of these in the last few videos. Um, Alright. I don't think I need 85 bajillion pieces of tissue paper, though. I have a lot of tissue paper. Okay. So, oof. Oof. Okay, go over there. All right, now we're missing a tag. Where did our tag go? Oh, there it is, it was hiding. So I really like this one. I think I'm gonna make this one into a pocket too, actually. I don't know, because that's a lot of journaling space. But I really like this one. This one came out really cool. Even with the mishap with the ink, that's funny. But that's okay, because we made it work. Hey, there's glitter in the ink. Y'all are not going to be able to see that. Eh, eh, nope. Mm -mm. Okay. Well, there's the first one. There's the second one. Also a flip. And then here is the third one. I don't know. I really like this one, too. <laughs> I don't know. I like, I guess it's just the blues. I really like blues. Blues, greens, purples. It doesn't matter. Anything with blue. I'm still getting that ink off my fingers. Oh my gosh. Okay. Anyway, that is it for today's video. That is the letter J. Uh, the next letter is K, and I will be back for that video later. So thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, bye guys.